The Pulse of Spokane is a broad show that showcases many different things in our community, sponsored by Local 29 Firefighters Union, Well-Dressed Walrus, and Homes for You. Well, welcome to this edition of The Pulse of Spokane. And, you know, I have, get to have a variety of guests, but I don't think I've ever had a ninja influencer. And so that's who we have today, Randy Jones. How are you, Randy? I'm doing great, Ken. How are you? I'm doing fine. You have, we were talking just before we went on the air here about your background and you were in the special force, special forces, and you've had quite a, a history of doing a lot of, can I say fun things, interesting things? Let's go with interesting. Sometimes <laughs> fun, sometimes not. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Um, what do you do? What are you doing now? What is what is your CEO at Ninja Influencer? But what is that? Well, Ninja Influencer, it, it, it's a two part system, or it's actually a three part system, but it came up in two parts. The word Ninja from my nephew, he dresses like a ninja, and always sneaking around. Yes. So, yes. I figured Ninja Influencer, we got to get to the customer some quiet way. <laughs> Okay, and, and not being so bold and obnoxious as so many other people are right now. Yeah, well, you and do it, business it, consulting. It, you do management consulting, project manage, management. What are some of the things that you really focus on, and who's your target? Right now, we've been working a lot with restaurants, breweries, and a handful of small businesses. To them, are closed up right now, so it's hard to get to them. But yeah, we just, I don't know, I got sick and tired of having our profit margins on a roller coaster ride all the time. So I developed a program that we can get off that economic roller coaster and start building a sustainable income that we can count on year in and year out. Yeah. You know, it's, uh, what, do you, what are you hearing from folks as you talk out there with all that's going on right now? You know, probably about 90 Probably, yeah, probably close to about 92% of the people out there are all itching to get the doors back open. Yeah. You know, they're, yeah. They're hurting economically so bad it's unreal. Yeah. And these so-called stimulus checks that are out there, <clears throat> yeah. It's going in the wrong pockets again. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's what happens when you just send it out to everybody in the world. And exactly. So forth. Yeah. 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 Um, as you talk with some of these folks, are you hearing that if this goes much longer that they're going to have to close their business or are they optimistic that they can get back to it? You know, for the most part, they're optimistic and they're very positive about getting back to it. I've got several out there and stuff. In fact, I have one who has 7,000 followers on his Facebook page. And they do post every day, I mean, every week. And nothing's working. It's still slow. And they're still at about 92% reduction in their profit margins. Wow. You know, so we went in and set them up with this program. And they have finally got back up to where they think they will be able to open up again. Oh, nice. So nice. About it. What, what, yeah. kinds of, what kinds of things do you do to get them to that point? What are, without giving away all the trade secrets, but I mean, what goes into helping a, a, a company that's 92% down to bring back to something they, at least they can break even for a while? Well, we call it the, the influencer effects. And it's a three-part system. Part one is we go in and we take a look at their, I mean, the only way that you can ever increase business, there's, there's two ways. You either spend money on marketing, or you go back and take a look at your loyal customers. So we yeah. put together a loyalty program, a very unique loyalty program that captures the data from all their uh, followers and stuff and all their customers. And then we go back and we market directly to them to increase the number of visits. Right. On average, with businesses, we're seeing that 
we increase it by three visits per year. That's a 300% increase in business. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. And, it's, and it's been working very, very well. You know, and I've heard in the past some marketers talk about, well, let's take a look at who your who your customer is. Okay, you've got that that audience already. Let's go after everybody else. But the fact is that you need to find more people like those that are coming in or buying from you because there are still those out there because that's an oh, yeah. easier yeah. But you know, it's like okay, we have uh, we have ninety percent of the young people. Let's go after the old people. No, no, no. You don't have ninety percent. Number one, okay. And, no. And, no. and number two, there are more out there of the young people, or whatever the you know the category might be. That's very very true. And you know, yeah. the second phase of our program is is that we ethically go in and we'll converse with our clients cut their friends, their neighbors, their co-workers, and we influence them to become loyal customers. Yeah, yeah. So it's, yeah, like I said, the three-part program, uh, and you know, the biggest one is the third part is where we get in and actually take the, um, uh, the establishments and employees and turn them into a ninja mar marketing machine. Yeah, yeah. And they're working comes down. now. It yeah. does come down to the frontline people. I mean, I don't it know how does. many times we've all mm -hmm. gone into a business and we've been turned off by something someone has said or done in the front of the building, if you will, the, the employee <laughs> that just, okay, I'm not, I, I, I'm guilty yeah. of it. I'm going, I'm not going back there. They don't care about me right. or, or whatever, you know? And, and so yeah. those of us that are the owners can be in the back room and not have any idea that you know those things are going on and unfortunately in today's social media world it happens instantaneously because they'll put a <laughs> yeah. post on facebook or twitter and the management knows nothing of it and the owner yeah. is the last to know and then yeah. he wonder why his business is down so we do a lot of reputation management also for yeah. organizations I, out there to keep them how, how, do you, how do you fix that how do you get management to to really involve more of their employees in being a serious part of the business? We just, we have a, a very good saying and it's just called follow the money. Yeah. And if they don't follow the money, they're never going to have the money. So yeah. Yeah. We look at what you have and we go from there. And, and, and the fact is it's not about the owner. It's about the employees that benefit from more activity in that business, whether it be a restaurant or a brewery or whatever it might be. Um, you know, it's easy to point to the guy or the gal in the back room who is making all the money, but you, right. you, it, it's not always that lucrative, number one. Number two, uh, he's making money for you as an employee as well, and you're making money right. for you. Yeah. You know, and how many times you've been in a restaurant where it's dead, and the yeah. waitress says, it's busy. This is busy? <laughs> yeah. Hello. <laughs> I mean, yeah. your wages go up, your tips go up when you have people in your restaurant. Yeah, absolutely. You know, you're absolutely. down the dirt, empty tables, so let's go. Yeah. Get with it. So your, your main focus are, uh, are what kinds of businesses, again, I know you said that earlier. We do a lot right now with restaurants and breweries. Okay. The brewery industry is just, it's went epidemic across the country. There are yeah. breweries everywhere. I mean, in Washington So primarily, State, primarily here in Spokane, ahead. Coeur d'Alene area? No, we uh, work up and down. Well, actually, we work across the United States. We have uh, six teams that are working out across the United States. We take care of the wow. West Coast. Okay. You know what I mean? I, we work up and down the I-5 court. Yeah, go ahead. I'm going to ask the question that I always ask everybody. Are you enjoying it? I love it. I wake Good. up every morning looking to help somebody somehow, yeah. some way. If I can do that, I go to sleep and I feel good. Yep. Great. How can people get in touch with you? They can uh, get in touch with us uh, through ninja, ninjainfluencer.com or they can call me directly at 
209-409-4930. All right. Thank you. Off to uh, make some appointments today, are you? Yes, we are. <laughs> All right. Well, Randy, uh, thank you very much. I've enjoyed chatting with you and the best of luck, and we'll be checking back with you. All right, Ken. You have yourself a great day. Thank you very much. You too. Thanks a lot. And thanks for watching The Pulse of Spokane. We'll see you next time right here. Oh, yeah. We believe every person is created in the image of God with immeasurable beauty and worth that people should not be defined by their present condition or past mistakes. We are all broken. We need each other. Healing for our brokenness begins with connection, with understanding how much we are loved by a good God. And with healing comes change, the potential for joy and meaning. No one was created for mere survival on the streets, for an existence blurred by mind-numbing substances. Each person is created with a purpose, a unique gift no one else can offer the world. Our job is to help them rediscover it. Real people, real change. Union Gospel Mission. Welcome to Apex Plaza, Spokane's one-stop cannabis destination. Apex Cannabis features thousands of economy, value, and luxury cannabis products. Canagear features hemp-based CBD products, glass, goods, and gear. Stop by 1325 North Division to experience the Apex difference. This product has intoxicating effects and may be habit forming. Marijuana can impair concentration, coordination, and judgment. Do not operate a vehicle or machinery under the influence of this drug. There may be health risks associated with the consumption of this product. For use only by adults 21 and older, keep out of the reach of children. The economy is getting stronger, banks are lending again, and interest rates are at historic lows. Now is a great time to buy your dream home. The caring and knowledgeable professionals at Homes for You have been helping people just like you for over 20 years. They take the time to listen to what you want and will help you find just the right home in Washington or Idaho. Real estate is what we do at Homes for You, 928-5782, or visit online at homes, the number 4, youspokane.com. Hi, this is Kurt Stockwell with Well-Dressed Walrus. We are a local website design and development company here in Spokane. What we do is build beautiful, usable websites for local businesses. A website needs to be beautiful. It needs to be usable for your users, your customers, and yourself. Contact us anytime. We'd love to talk with you about your online marketing. Thanks for watching. Ask the host a question, recommend a guest, or check out any of our other programs on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or SpokaneTalksMedia.com. Sponsored by Local 29 Firefighters Union, Well-Dressed Walrus, and Homes for You.